guys welcome back to my channel so I have a Dollar Tree haul it's a decent size one <clears throat> some of this stuff is from the other night I went by myself and I've just been waiting to post a video and then I went today since I don't have my kids um, I'm actually trying to do another DIY I can't do it I'm probably gonna have to do it next year and I'll just make sure I get everything I need for it as soon as I start putting the Easter stuff out so it's fine because I don't even have room for it right now. So um, before I start, I got two cards today in the mail. All I did was cut the tops. This one is from Selena Sweet. And there's Snoopy with some eggs. There's Ariel, Forky, Buzz, Woody. And then this one says Spring. And then there's Ariel and Flounder. So cute. Thinking of you and wishing you happy moments shared with those you love it has this cute little bunny it's such a cute card oh wow thinking of you and wishing you a beautiful easter oh you are so awesome oh my goodness you guys so she sent me a strip of frozen stickers shannon is gonna love these so i'll let her keep those but you guys, she sent me Nightmare Before Christmas stickers. So there's this one. There's this one. I think there's two of each. With Jack and Sally. This one. Oh, this one's so cool with the snake that forms a heart. This one's Jack by himself. And then this one is Sally. Thank you so much. You did not have to do that. That is so sweet. I'll send you a little Easter card. I picked up some extras, so thank you so much. And I'll hang that on my wall right here. I have some. This one is from Queen's Life. Hey girl, I got your card. Um, you guys, look at these little coffee cups. Oh my goodness, those are so cute. And then there's a whole bunch of llamas and stars. <clears throat> thinking of you that's really pretty oh and she included a sheet of star stickers hope this card puts a smile on your face thank you for sharing all your hauls I love them continue doing great bless you and your family and her YouTube name is Queen's Life so thank you so much hun for the card that was so sweet I will send you a little card in return as a thank you love doing friend mail even if it's not a holiday no reason I just I love it so we're gonna jump into this haul there is some food here and then I picked up some more puzzles because I've been doing like a puzzle every day and there's two puzzles that I cannot do I tried they are really hard the one with all the cats in the basket I can't do that one and the one with the birds on the mail like the little um, bird feeder in the tree like I don't know if I just chose to do them on the wrong day and like I just wasn't into it but anyways I got some stuff so let's get into it um, I needed ribbon for my jars I'm gonna do that after this video and I will post a picture on my community tab you guys will see it because I didn't like the way it was and I didn't have that last year for Easter or no I did but I had purple mason jars that I painted so I didn't have the ribbon and the ribbon I used for giant tumblers that I put candy in that I had in my living room, but I didn't do that this year. So that's why I didn't have enough ribbon. Um, and I thought I did cause I didn't remember that I used the mason jars last year. So I picked up this one and it kind of looks like burlap and it says, well, it is burlap and it says happy Easter all over it. There's bunnies, flowers. So I picked up two so that way I can wrap. Usually I can use one, but I just wanted to be sure and if I have extra, that's okay. So I picked up the ribbon for my jars. Um, I picked up some more puzzles. So I already hauled this one and I did it and it's missing a piece. So I don't know if I dropped the piece somewhere. I've been looking all over my house for it. I can't find it anywhere. So I have a feeling that it didn't, it was missing a piece already when I started, like when I opened it. I'm hoping not and I'm hoping I can find it, but We'll see what happens. My sister fell in love with it, and so I picked her up one. So the 300 pieces, that's what it looks like. 
she fell in love with it so I'm gonna send her this and some more little things for her and my nephews so I'll save that for her I got these are gonna be hard too this one has butterflies all with the rainbow I love that this one I picked up this one with the different flowers and then I went and picked up this one and it has like sweet treats on it. That's so cute. This one has 500. All the rest are 300, but this one's five. So I picked up four more puzzles for me and then a puzzle for my sister. Um, I saw Simply Jessica. Hey girl, I saw you haul this and my other Dollar Tree was out of the fox. All they had was the frog and my the closer Dollar Tree to me had them. So I, I was able to pick it up. And it's the little fox and it has the solar on the back so it lights up the eyes so so cute and then I saw these on Instagram and I just texted my bestie about them yesterday and my store had them they're already having a little shelf area for Mother's Day gifts and this was with there so they also had a blue one and a pink one but I chose the yellow because yellow was my dad's favorite color and you put a candle tea light candle in here and then you can put wax cubes but I don't know if I would use that for that I'd probably put a candle in there like one of those fake ones to light it up but I absolutely fell in love with this I love that it looks like a little beehive and then it has the flower they also had butterflies that you can put a tea light and then they had statues of butterflies but I picked up this I didn't want to go crazy and buy every color so I just picked up the yellow found some new candles they had two more and I did not like the scent. One was Coral Poppy. I almost picked it up just because the jar was really pretty. It was like a coral pink color and then they had a mango something and it was like a yellowish into an ombre of a green. So this one's Berry Smash and this one smells the best out of all of them in my opinion. And it's this really pretty blue jar. Oh, it just smells like a bowl of berries. Like it smells amazing. So that's what it looks like. And it is a soy blended scented candle with essential oils. And it is green briar. So I picked up that one. And then I picked up this one, which is really pretty. And this one's Waterfall Rush. This one is okay. No, it's it smells really clean, like, like a clean bathroom scent. So I just mainly got it for the jar, this one. This one I actually got for the scent. I don't really care for the color of the jar, but I was really happy to find some new candles. I also saw this. Now this thing is huge, you guys. It's so heavy, 16 ounce. I'm actually gonna open this because this is for me. Oh my God. This is like, you hear that? This is the biggest bath bomb I've ever seen in my life. Like this thing is huge. And to get it for a dollar, oh that smells good. So it's Rainbow Sherbert, the Big Fizz, Spa Life. They only had one scent, but they had a whole bunch on the shelf. I just gave myself a pedicure and I didn't think about using this, but that's okay. The next time I do one, I'll use this I don't even have a bucket to do a pedicure like a, a bath like a to soak my feet I can't even talk right now um so I'll have to get a bucket or something to use but I just thought this was cool I might go and pick up a few more because this would be really nice for gifts but this thing is huge you guys like I just showed you it's a 16 ounce bath bomb for a dollar so I picked up that. I was really excited to see that. I picked up two more nail polishes and they look the same, but they're not. So they're probably gonna show up the same on camera. This one is Pink Vibe. And it's like a nude pink. And I might give this one to my sister. And then this one is Bling Babe. So you can tell they are a little different. This one's more pink, this one's more like orangey peachy so I got those two they had a whole bunch they had a light yellow a light really light light green like Easter colors they were really pretty um, I also picked up these and I'm gonna keep one for myself and I'm gonna give these ones to my sister because they have pineapples on them they're hot cold iPads compress um, 
helps relieve puffy eyes, reusable, use chilled or heated. So these are just like the cucumber and kiwi ones, but this one has pineapples. So the, those are gonna go with a candle holder for my sister. And then I'm gonna keep these for myself. And I'm gonna see if this will help with my headaches too, um, not just for my eyes. But this one has like pretty flowers on it. So I got that one as well. That's it for like the beauty stuff. Oh no, I did pick up this. This is for somebody, you know who you are. You said you wanted one. So I'm gonna send it with your watermelon face wipes. I'm gonna send that out this week on Thursday. So I'm gonna add this with it. And then speaking of watermelon, you guys, oh, I'm so glad my store had this. Like, this is life. You're one in a melon and it has it on both sides. There's also a dish towel, but the dish towel has lemons on it with watermelons. And then I saw online they have platters for the summer and it has the watermelons and the lemons on it too. So I don't know if I'm gonna want all of that. I do want at least one dish towel so I can hang it on my coffee bar, but I had to get this coffee cup and I was so glad to see it. And it's a really nice size. So I'm actually gonna go through my coffee cups and I'm gonna get rid of a whole bunch. We're having another yard sale maybe next month and, or we're gonna wait till after all this blows over, but there's just a lot that I don't use. So I only wanna keep the ones that I use and I'm definitely gonna be using this one. I was so happy to see that. Um, we're gonna jump into some food real quick. I wanna save some of the good stuff for last. I saw this, it's a really good deal. It doesn't expire until December of this year and it's Italian dressing. Um, we only have a ranch and that's it. So I wanted to pick this up. I got a Dr. Pepper. I got one more of the bonus and it was hidden behind a bunch of little ones. So look at your store, move some of the front ones that are little cause they try to get you with the little ones and check and see if it has the bonus size. My husband already went through all of them. So he's been loving having the Sunny D in the house. And if I can get it for a dollar, that's a good deal. It was the only one left. Like I said, all the rest were little. There actually was one more, but it was damaged and I didn't want it. So I just picked up one more. I'm gonna be doing some Easter treats for my husband's coworkers. And I'm doing them this week. I can't find Czech cereal anywhere. So I don't think I'm gonna be able to make Muddy Buddies. I'm gonna do my pretzels. And I found a recipe on Pinterest and it calls for Funfetti cake mix, but it's not a cake, it's something else. I might do a video of that. I'll see how I feel about it because I've never done it before, but it seemed pretty easy, so I might film. And I needed a box of Funfetti cake mix. I think I have one in my pantry, so if I need to double it, I can. And if not, I'll just make one and then I can always make just like chocolate chip cookies and add those in their bags as well. And then I went ahead and picked up a yellow cake um, just to have in my pantry in case I want to make cake pops or a cake. So I went ahead and picked up those two. I got these. I've never tried this flavor. I know I have a feeling I'm going to like it. It's just a really small bag, so I didn't want to get a whole bunch. But I love Harvest Snaps Green Peas Snacks. Um, this one's a sharp and creamy white cheddar and I've never tried this one. So I got a bag to try that. I'll let you guys know. I'll let you guys know how those are. I picked up a bag of the Popcorners white cheddar. I needed some parchment paper. I got this the other night and a thing of paper plates. I didn't want to go crazy with the paper plates cause there wasn't a lot on the shelf and I'm not trying to be greedy. So I only picked up one. They brought back my sweet tart bites so I only picked up one bag I got one more of these these were really good but I only ate the orange the grape and the strawberry I don't like pineapple but my husband said they were all good so I picked up another bag and then they had these and they also sell the rainbow ones I hauled from the 99 cent store so if you don't have a 99 cent store check your Dollar Tree because I saw them at one of my Dollar Trees not all of them have them but I did see them there. So some Dollar Trees are carrying those if you don't have a 99 cent store. Um, but I don't always see these. So I grabbed four because the hubby loves these. So I picked up more for him, he'll be happy. And I've never seen this there before. So I don't know if I've just never paid attention, but I love Tootsie Rolls and I love the orange and like strawberry Tootsie Rolls. 
So they're fruit chews, mini bites, candy coated chews, and it doesn't tell you the flavors, but like there's orange, lemon, cherry, and or lime, lemon, and blue raspberry. So I tried those. I'm gonna try these and see how I like those. That's it for the food. Last few things. Found some wish list items besides the coffee cup and the wax warmer and the little fox. Something boring real quick, I picked up these. I hauled the little tiny one that's over there with my Easter bag in it with the truck. And I love the wood grain design. So these are eight by tens. Um, I'm either gonna see if puzzles will fit in this or um, I'll just keep them for DIYs or for actual pictures. So I just went ahead and picked up two because these ones are really, really nice compared to the like regular black ones. So I got two of those. I picked up four more Easter cards. I just went ahead and picked up the ones that come in the plastic because they're different. This one says for some bunny special. I love the little jute bow. This one says Easter fun. There's a chick and a rabbit in a hot air balloon. This one has a gold egg with a little purple bow. And then this one says happy Easter and there's a bunny with an egg. So I'm gonna send those out tomorrow morning to the people that sent me some, that I didn't realize were gonna send me some. These were with the Mother's Day stuff as well on an end cap. So my, my store has Mother's Day stuff on an end cap by like, the picture frames and like the florals that they keep year round in that aisle on the very end of it they had some mother's day stuff and then when i went today they had a different little section over by the impulse buy stuff on a little display thing with the warmers but they had a bunch of different journals um i'm missing something sorry about that so i actually didn't get it um something else i thought i had but so it has the little strand thingy to the elastic band to hold it so it's really pretty pink it says live love create they had a bunch of different ones with different designs and there's 60 sheets in here and it is lined so i picked that up just to have either i'll keep it for myself or i can always throw it into some friend mail or i can throw it into a giveaway so i picked up that my daughter is, like I've said, all about world tour, troll, uh, the Trolls second movie. She's getting into Trolls again and she can't wait to see it. So I picked up this reusable bag. I forgot to take a bag with me that day and I'd rather pay a dollar for one like this than 10 cents for a plastic one. So I picked up this one and it has the little characters on it and then it's pink. So I know she'll like that. She hasn't seen it yet cause she's not here. And then I also picked up the wall decals to add to her room. I did show her these and she's so excited. And it has the new characters on there. So you get 11 and I'll have her help me put those in her room. Two more things and that's it. And these are wish list items. I'm so excited. So above my washer and dryer, my husband, I want him to build me a shelf because I don't have a shelf there. But right now the wall is just plain white and plain and boring so when I saw this on Instagram I was like I need that to hang in between my washer and dryer to give it a little bit of a nicer feel in there and it says wash open 24 hours laundry and then it has the clothes pin it is crooked um not as bad but it is so I'm gonna see if I can maybe pull that off without damaging this and fix it and if not then that's fine I'll just leave it they were all crooked. I looked at every single one. So this one is really crooked and it bugs me. Like, why would they do that? I know it's a dollar, but still. This was the other one I really wanted. It has the buffalo check and it says blessed and grateful. So I was so glad to finally talk, take these off my wish list and the watermelon cup and the little fox. So that's it for this video, you guys. I hope you enjoyed. If you did, give it a big thumbs up. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. I'd love for you to be part of my YouTube family if you're not already. And until then, I'll see you guys next time. Bye.